ducked in there for about two hours until our own tanks came along. Mm -hmm. And then they supposedly blew the enemy out of the bunker. And we were then, by that time, we were called back, pulled off to the back. Mm -hmm. And another time we were up on top of the hill. I don't know how many there was up there of us, but I, I and my, uh, there was four of us on the mortar. Um, I was the gunner, and then there was the assistant gunner that dropped the round down, and then there was ammo bearers that brought the ammunition up. That time we had to dig our foxhole and sit in the foxhole, well, about halfway through the night, a shell landed right outside and the ground caved in on us. We had a struggle yet to get out, but we made it out. And uh, then we went into a bunker with some higher ranked people were in because we didn't we couldn't do nothing with our with our mortar because it was dented, so we couldn't drop no rounds down it. And, but those were then I went on a couple of patrols, nighttime patrols, with uh, about ten guys. They they were scary too, because you never knew if you ever run into an enemy or anything. How young were you? Twenty one. Well, at that time, over in Korea, I was 22. I spent my 22nd, I think it was 22nd birthday, on a boy, boat going over to Korea. When did you get out? I got out in uh, 53, March 18th of 53. I got out in 21, I only had to put in 21 months because they said that I had my time in and I made it back before the 21 months were up so they left me out. I did do a little training of new guys for about a month or two, but then they left me out. I even had to, I don't know what you call it, an honor or what, but one of the guys that was in the company that we were training did not want to take direct orders. Well, then he got put in the stockade and he, I had to take him for his court martial. And, um, they said that right the day his court mar actual court martial came up the day I got out of the army, so I, I did, there was another guy that was guarding them with me, and so he had to take them. And, but the way they told me, they figured he'd get 15 years in Leavenworth for disobeying the direct orders. 